Kansas City, Kansas family is looking for a new place to live tonight after a fire destroyed most of their belongings. Chris Hernandez talked with the victims of the fire. Chris? Well, Mark, 12 people were in that house when the fire broke out. It was a mom, her nine children, and two adult cousins. The tenants say the home had not had a working furnace since they moved in last November. The house near 60th and Oakland caught fire around midnight. The family broke this back window to get out. Andrea Underwood and one daughter have stitches after being cut by glass. I was panicking and my cousins were busting the window out because we couldn't find a way out. We couldn't lift the window or anything. So we just started getting all the kids out there as fast as we could. Underwood says she and her nine children lost everything, escaping barefoot in their pajamas. Her children are from six months to 16 years old. An electric toaster oven apparently sparked the fire. It, along with a gas oven, were heating the home. The house is not up to cold at all. Atmos Gas Company confirms workers came out January 5th but refused to hook up the furnace because of a faulty line. Underwood says she withheld January's rent to try to force the landlord to fix it. He didn't... Um take care of his business. If so, we would have had a working furnace with no gas leak and we would have had working smoke detectors. This man wouldn't confirm he's the landlord, but he fits the description and he came back to the house with an insurance agent. Were you having a problem with her as a tenant? He refused to answer any questions. The Red Cross is putting the family up in this hotel room for just a couple of days. Underwood says she's having trouble now getting help because of her dispute with the landlord. She says she had been planning to file a complaint about the landlord, but tonight she's more worried about just finding clothes for her children and a new home to rent. Chris Hernandez, NBC Action News.